politics. You know, the word politics, taken from the ancient Greek, poly meaning many, and ticks meaning tiny blood-sucking insects. <laughs> 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 I'm not sure I'm allowed to make that joke anymore. But... Do by these presents advance, create, and prefer our trusty and well-beloved Michael John Dobbs is gone. But it's only the uncertainty that causes that destruction. And that's what this bill does away with. There'll be a reasoned, if possibly somewhat reckless campaign of tax cuts, heady promises, and kissed constituency babies. In other words, business as usual. I'm from the BBC. You don't look much like the BBC. Could you not see this coming? Shelley Barnes with the Washington Herald reporting a source close to the president. Not exactly sure how it got leaked. I want it over. I'm sorry, Mr. President, but I will not do that. Get ready, Kathy. Things are about to move very quickly. Okay. You know, bring it into a modern context, but still keep that same delicious, uh, diabolical quality. Winston was a man of many foibles. You take reality and then you water it down just to make it oh. I suddenly found myself alongside a woman who was changing the world. I turned around to her and I said, you've won, you're prime minister. And I remember that wonderful day when I was asked to be the conservative chief of staff. I was young, I was naive, and I thought this was the most exciting thing that I could be asked to do. And I rushed round the pub to tell all my friends. I burst in, the doors went flying, I said, isn't it wonderful? They want me to be the chief of staff. Chief of staff? It's chief of staff. I said, what does it mean, chief of staff? And I said, I don't know, but isn't it wonderful? <laughs> <laughs> it's a brand new job for me. And so they said, look, before you lose all sense of perspective, sit down, have a drink, and we should think of some other political chiefs of staff on whom you might model this new job. So that's what we did. Sat down, had a drink, and we came up with two. Two political chiefs of staff. One was Bob Haldeman, who was chief of staff to President Richard Nixon. And they let him out on parole after three years. <laughs> um, the other one was Martin Borman, who was chief of staff. <laughs> And somebody shot him, so uh, I'm very glad to be able to be here this evening. 